This next application, I'm going to introduce our Vice President of Engineering, John Boylan, and uh, he's going to talk about this very interesting uh, application and uh, maybe a little bit about his after hours uh, work in hobbies. Thank you, Tom. Uh, good morning, everyone. Um, I had the pleasure to work with uh, students at Virginia Tech. This is a senior design project where they built an all-electric motorcycle. They entered what is the TTX GP75 class, which limits uh, the energy storage to 7.5 kilowatt hours. There's basically two classes that were running in these AMA races, 75 class and then the open class. 2013, we're, we're going to the open class, but in this year, uh, we did the 75 class. The whole trick to this was to take that amount of energy, do the required amount of warm-up, sighting laps, warm-up laps, the race itself, and then the, the, the uh, cool-down lap. Uh, you want to spend all the energy and you know, no more, no less. You want to get around uh, the track. So uh, we've got a video on this I'd like to show you. VT Bolt is an electric motorcycle team. What's different from this bike as far as all the other electric bikes is uh, the, the drivetrain we really have in there. Our drivetrain is from Cole Morgan and it's uh, a lot more sophisticated than some of the others that you'll see out there. The Bolt project has really ignited my desire for electric vehicles making something innovative. I guess inventing the future, if you will. We entered three races and we won our class in all three races. It was uh, very exciting. And one of the, so it's not only a, a place for us to work on technology, we, we uh, uh, produced our, lo, the first low voltage motorcycle system using uh, an ACS 80 volt converter running at 600 amps. Uh, and we modified an AKM servo motor to match up with the uh, exact conditions for this particular application. So AKM comes in over Tom's <laughs> half a million permutations and combinations that are possible. Well, this one was a little outside of that, but we were able to, with uh, um, some co-engineering work with the students at Virginia Tech, uh, come up with a application-specific solution in, in the motor to match perfectly uh, for this motorcycle. Uh, they're running um, uh, at 60 kilowatts uh, peak, and uh, again, matching up with this uh, lithium ion polymer battery that was uh, running at limited to 7.5 kilowatt hours. Um, tremendous fun exercise, uh, but what's most innovative and most uh, rewarding is is working with the students in taking their ideas it 's their project, and we provided a sponsorship and supported them in, in a way where where they they got a lot of excitement uh, for the university uh, so a lot of press and um, 
it, and for us, it's a, a great recruiting ground as well because we get to learn the students and uh, they get to learn us.